I'm trying to welcome my guest. He doesn't want me to introduce me. <laughs> Softly spoken with no strings tying you to me. I'm happy in your company with no emotion because my love. Hi, guys. Um, you're welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Rich, and this is my first video ever. Yeah, finally, I get to post the video. I've been postponing it for a long while. Like, I've been saying, okay, I'll shoot today, I'll shoot tomorrow. I'll do this and that, but mm, I don't know. But finally, I get to post my video on YouTube, and this is my first video. And before I go on, please, guys, I want to appeal to you guys to please subscribe to my YouTube channel and please click the notification button so whenever I post any video, you can get the notification that I posted. And it's going to be an interactive um channel is not going to bore you so first of all welcome like i said before and today i have two special announcements before i go into the topic of today the first one is that today is my son's birthday oh my god like i'm super excited i'm so happy he is one he is one year old yeah <laughs> My son will be one today. Oh, my son is one today. Sorry for that. My son is one today and I'm so, so excited. And I, that's why I want to launch my YouTube channel on his birthday. And my second announcement is that, <laughs> get ready. <laughs> I have a special guest on my show today. Like my very first video and I'm having a guest. Isn't that amazing? So you guys will get to meet my guest. I mean, He's camera shy but i had to i had to drag him i had to pay for him to get here so it's so that it will be more interactive and uh, i don't want to take much of your time so today this my channel will be talking about lifestyle everything marriage relationship god every single thing except gossip of course <laughs> you don't expect me to gossip on my channel no i'm not going to do that i won't I won't. Mm -mm -mm. so you guys can also help me in the comment section and just write something or tell me what you want me to talk about i mean we can discuss about it when i'm done and when i post the video you can go to the comment section and put in your contribution i mean i'll be reading through of course i will be reading through so and today mine i'm going to start with of course today is my son's birthday so we are going to talk about my son it's going to be about him today, his birthday. So we are going to talk about my childbirth, my the pregnancy journey, the delivery, life after childbirth, you know, first time mom and the rest of them. So and before I go into that, I will have to welcome my guests. He will be the one to uh we'll talk about it so that it will be more juicy. So without taking much of your time, my dear community, <laughs> please grab your popcorn grab your drink i'm trying to work on my guest he doesn't want me to introduce me <laughs> Hi, guys everyone. guys meet my first guest on my show like i'm Where so excited happy? i am super excited please today is my son's birthday and i'm having you on my show isn't that amazing it's amazing so this is mr carlos he happens to be my husband yeah so yeah, i am excited <laughs> that you're my husband so we're going, to, we're going to be talking about men, the pregnancy journey, delivery, whatever, you understand. So I promise it's going to be juicy. So, and I had to write some things that I wrote down questions for him. I think he will do more of the talking. I'll do more of the asking of the question. You understand, you know, so that it will be more interactive. So please guys, let's go into it. Ah, uh, man. Okay. The first question I have for you. Sorry. Welcome to my channel, Thank Mr. You. Carlos. How are you today? I'm good. You're good. You're excited. It's good to be here. <laughs> you, have, you have the privilege to be here. He's, ah, he's an honor. No, it's not a privilege. <laughs> it's good. I know you're happy to be here. Like, you didn't know I would take you this far. <laughs> For your mind. I'm telling you. Okay, okay, okay. So, the, your first question right. is um, 
what was your reaction when I told you that we were pregnant? That day, I, I know I snapped. Okay, before then, I how I told you, it wasn't dramatic. I just took the test when I was in my office and I snapped the two red lines and I sent it to him. He was in his office also. So I sent it to him. So what went through your mind immediately when you saw my message that we were pregnant? How did you feel? Be honest. Definitely, I'm gonna be honest. Okay. It, uh, it's 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 simple. It's yeah. just that I I knew you were pregnant, but it's a lie. I'm serious. I'm doing, I I knew you were pregnant. I'm just hearing the, sorry. I'm embarrassed because I'm hearing this for the first time. Yes, you have to be embarrassed. You you took one year to tell me this because I know who I am. You know? So I knew you we were pregnant. So when, when I heard the news, I was so. How did you know I was pregnant, please? Uh, because. I did that thing, so I'm going to cut. I'm going to cut. You did what? Is like okay. Then, I, okay. I impregnated you, so I knew when you were pregnant. So what are you going to tell the world? Excuse me. Excuse me. This one is embarrassing me. It's getting excited, right? This one is embarrassing me. You didn't expect that. Hold on. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait a minute. Okay, let's go, Ross. Since you want to talk. Okay. Wait. Like it wasn't the, our first time of, you know, you understand. Yeah. So why did you not think that at that particular time I was pregnant? How did you not know that at that particular time I was pregnant? Because we were, we were making love always, so I knew that, that I the child was coming very soon. So when I heard the news, I was not that surprised, but I was just happy. That I was I, pregnant. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad that. Like I told you before, I'm expecting a son, and you were doubting me. Hold on, right? we've not got it to that part okay. because don't, I don't, I don't want to get angry. Okay, don't be. <laughs> okay, okay, that's. But I was excited though when I heard that. Yeah, I, yeah. I saw, it, I saw yes. the excitement on your face when you got home. So, I we were excited, of course. Who wouldn't be? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. So the, your second question is, how was the pregnancy journey for us? In the aspect yeah. of was i too demanding was i stressing you out or did i manage it well talking about demanding you were not uh, uh, at all you managed the pregnancy so well that i was amazed I'm i saw the strength in you and you were Aww. doing so well i was i was excited that you, you could hold on to it and here we are today brian came out Success. <sighs> okay, so yeah, so I managed it well. I didn't yeah. stress you. Yeah, you didn't. I think next time I have to stress you. Okay. So let's know the truth. Which one is better? <laughs> so when other men are saying no, it's no easy. When my wife, you follow them and talk. I will tell them what's up. Mm -hmm. yeah. So I think I think sorry if you're hearing the cry of my son at the background. Sorry about that. I mean, what do you expect? We are talking about him, so you have to hear his voice. <laughs> sorry about that. Okay, so of course I managed it well. I wasn't to the, I knew I, God gave me the strength. Yeah. God gave yeah. so just God because so I thought it I would easy. be so demanding here and there, but I, I, I you know what? It didn't even show that you were was, pregnant. Yeah, yeah, it didn't show. It was yeah. after birth. After birth, yes. It didn't show. I was just normal. I ate normal. I didn't overeat. I did. I was just okay. Exactly. I was just, and I had more strength because I could do things even till I gave birth. Before I gave birth, I was cooking and you know, all those things. So I, I just thank God. I didn't know. Tell them I was helping you in the kitchen. <laughs> Jesus. Uh -huh. <laughs> this man is embarrassing me. Like, is it a privilege or not? Is it not our house? Why would you help me? Why would you do it? I I'm might be good. saying help. You know I'm good. You're supposed to say you were helping me, please. Oh, sorry about that. You should. But, that, but I was there for high know what I'm saying. You, yeah, you try. You try. You need to step up a bit next time. Maybe I will give you a list of what you'll be doing. <laughs> I know I'll do it. Okay, so fast forward to delivery day. That's your next question. Did you have any fear in you that... Did you have any fear in you during the labor, or were you so confident that God will come true for us? I won't lie. Uh, I won't lie to you. As a human, I was a bit scared, but when I remember that I have, I have God, I have Jesus, that confidence came through me, and I, I was just holding on and believe 
Guys, I think I think this guy is lying. I'm not lying. Do you know why I say I think he's lying? Why? I was in pain. This man was sleeping in the hospital. <laughs> <laughs> like it was even my mom that was waking him up. This guy had his headphones on. He was oh oh god. Because I had that computer that you this guy, but you're going to pull through. That's at least why. at least you could continue reminding God like God, we are still here. We are still here. Make it happen. Why are you and, 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 and you were they didn't allow me to come in. Your wife wait. You love me, right? Definitely, I do. You do. You care about me. For real. Do you want, do you want to see me in pains? I wouldn't want if that. If I'm in pains, you should be in pains. Yeah, right? Definitely. So where were you sleeping? I was outside. Yeah, you were outside, but you, you should be like walking up that, and down. Tell them what happened to me outside. <laughs> what happened? The mosquito what happened slept to me. Out. They didn't allow you in. This is my fault. The mosquito didn't allow me to go my house. But seriously, why were you, you were not supposed to sleep? It was my mom that but, was But you age. know what? I, I, I think uh, I, I would recommend that hospital because it, for the fact that they didn't allow me to come inside. Uh, and they managed it well. They managed it very well. For the fact that they didn't need me. But, I was kind they of just worried. call you whenever the need yeah. arises. You understand? But at least they should allow the husband inside. Like I normally see other other people. <laughs> have you? No, everybody have their policy. Just like what they say, they don't. You don't. They, you, they don't allow you snap your baby immediately. You give birth. You remember that? Yeah, they, they don't, don't snap. Don't, they have their own policy. I mean, all hospitals have their own policy. I don't know. I don't know. But though we still stole one or two pictures. I. I. He. He was. I heard that he was sleeping. And by then, me, I was already running mad there and there. So I, God helped me. God was there for me or for us. I went into the level and around two something, two twenty something. Two thirty, two thirty two. Wow, that was when I called you. Because immediately I put I to asked, bed. I asked. No, I put to bed and I called. You know, I was thirsty. They said they brought my phone. I was still in the neighborhood. They brought my phone. They said I should call you guys a, 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 to get me water. A minute I gone, gone, gone past you. Yeah, probably. So I now called you guys to get me water that our son has arrived. Glory be to Jesus. Ah, finally. <laughs> so, 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 that was it. And um, I think this, we've answered the second question because I just wrote how this second, this last question. How did you feel at the hospital when I when you got the call from me that Brian has arrived? I couldn't wait to see the, the young man. The nigga. He nigga. calls him the nigga. It's my little man. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't wait to see him, but at, at, at that moment, they, they didn't still allow me inside. I just had to. But later you came in. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah and when we came out of the labor to the ward, where we were, so when, that was when they now came. Allowed me in. To see my little man, I saw him. and he was so handsome, just like the father. You know what I'm saying? Excuse me. Ah, what are you talking? About? Accuse me, accuse me. Who was handsome like the father? <laughs> Please, I will post the picture now. You will see him. <laughs> so look at his face and look at my face. You see, even the boy carried my seat as in everything, everything. He has everything. <laughs> Sorry, the girl would, would look like you. All right. No Girls look like their dad and boys like their mom. It's just natural. It's just natural. So don't worry. Don't don't be. Then another point that I miss, the <clears throat> gender review. When we went to when we went for scan to check the sex. <laughs> <laughs> you want to embarrass yourself now? I was actually, to um, be honest, I wanted a baby girl. No, but you just reminded me that thing now. I forgot. To Man. be honest, I wanted a baby girl because I'm the only girl and I yeah, desperately yes, need a true, girl. It's true, it's true, it's true, it's true. I have four brothers plus husband. So men, five, men. five men. What am I doing with five? Ah, you are capable enough now to handle ah, Four brothers, one father, one husband, six men. Oh God, only me. Hey. So I wanted a girl by all means. But my mind was shot telling me that I, I'm, I was going to have a boy because my desperation would even change the baby girl to boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so when we went for scan, a guy was busy laughing it at me. It overwhelmed your imagination. That's why that boy just happened. A guy was busy because... laughing at me when they told us that he, he was going to be a boy. Of course, baby is baby. Like. baby is baby. No matter, no matter and I, funny enough, I even am obsessed with the guy, self, with my son. Like, Don't worry. He's so cute. That's fine. I'm girls, there's one, I want two girls, twins. Hmm. God is listening to you, man. Amen. 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 Okay, so last question, last question. How does it feel to be a father? Wow. 
That's a big question. That's a fear to be a father. And, and, and that question is very, very important because yeah. being a father demands a lot in, the, in terms of, um, you know, now sometimes I just sit down and remember those things I used to do when I was in school. The gangsterism and the nigga who thing. Ah, God. Thank God that he came to my rescue. Because being a father has you very clear, my people. I won't lie to you. Defense is clear. But <laughs> all I think about is my family. All he thinks about is Brian. <laughs> Actually. <laughs> Don't mind him. Family is Brian to him. <laughs> Brian is family. So Let's, I, no, I, I am say. keeping it real. Let's be yeah, honest. Real, you know me, you know but, me, I don't paint words. But what? No, 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 no. You what know. are you insinuating? No, man? you know me, I don't paint words. So, he, family is Brian. <clears throat> Meaning? Meaning, uh, no, I Meaning understand. What? They Say understand. No, they understand. But as let, let's jokes aside, I mean, he's a great father. Like, see, I never. I don't even know how to say he's a. a, a My head, he's not. I'm serious. Bigger. I'm not saying you're a great husband. I say you're a great. <laughs> <laughs> There's the difference between the two. He's a he's a powerful father. I swear. Like, he, how do you do so well? Well, it's, seriously. It's just and they, they they stay the same place all day, all night. They connect so well. That's a bloodline. Yeah. yeah, the blood is so strong. Even though the boy doesn't look like him, but his blood, <laughs> he has more of his blood inside of him. Seriously, he they, they connect so well. The the guy, whenever he's around, my son blanks I and the nanny. We do, we don't matter again to him. He's just his father, except when he's hungry. And you get what I'm saying. So, but he is such a great father. He does it well. He does it well. He Thank does you. it. He does it well. I swear, he does it well. If he maintains the but this like this this speed like this eh? ah ha ah, the children won't miss it in life I swear they won't Definitely you're doing won't. well thank you're you. doing well God thank bless you, you. God doing bless well you as well God bless thank you no Brian <coughs> see that nigga it's it's what come on don't come my nigga so it's okay nigga, <laughs> so that is it and I hope I hope yeah we at least we covered almost everything because i don't want it to be so long we don't want to bore you guys so finally the wish is what do you wish your son to do that is his birthday i mean i wish him god's protection uh, Amen. i wish him long life i wish he he, he will be the head not the tail yeah. god will supply all his needs according to his riches brian is brian is covered mm -hmm. he knows that even god himself knows it so I wish him all the best in life. Thank you guys for tuning to my YouTube channel. Well, I... And I beg you guys to subscribe. Please. No thanks. I just want to shout <laughs> So, I wish my son a happy birthday. Happy birthday, Brian. <clears throat> it will be a stepping stone for him. Yeah. for him. Yeah, no, I'll post this. If he comes in, man, he will destroy this camera. Please. I'll just post this picture. You know what I'm saying? My son is a Taliban man. No, he, you know, he's so hyperactive. So <clears throat> I bless him today as his mother. Amen. Bless him in the morning, afternoon, and night. Amen. God's glory will shield him. Amen. God will have him in, his, in the hollow of his hands. Amen. Nothing will befall him. Amen. No plague will come near his dwelling. Amen. He will be the head and Amen. not the tail. He will Amen. be above and not beneath. Amen. Where people go and fail, he will go and succeed. Amen. What stopped the father won't stop him. Amen. What stopped the mother won't stop him. Amen. He will make it in life on time. Amen. He won't regret anything in this life. He Amen. will serve God diligently Amen. in Jesus' name. And Amen. as a result of this, we reach out to those that are waiting. We ask that as a result of, as um, Brian is celebrating his one year birthday, may God remember those that are waiting Amen. and grant them the desires of their hearts. Amen. God will bless you guys. God will establish you. God will give you your own child. God will give you the desires of your heart. Amen. It will not be cut short. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. So, guys, thank you so much. If you thank watched you till this point, that means you actually enjoyed this video. And we ask you to subscribe and uh, click on the notification button. We will see you again. And I promise to be consistent on this channel by God's grace. It's not, it's not easy. So, thank you so, so, thank so you guys. very much. And God bless you. So, Bye.